Hi Leo, this is Shah from Charlie's Angel Tarot and wow, your cards just somehow seem to jump out. This is the most uh, psychedelic, uh, vibrant uh, uh, spread that I've seen yet, although the Archangel Michael um, uh, Metatron sorry, cards are vibrant. But this jumps jumps off the table. Okay, l welcome, and uh, if you're new as well, welcome to my Cyber Angels. Thanks for coming back. You make it really uh, fantastic, the channel. Without me, uh, without you, uh, it wouldn't be so special as it is now. I love my Cyber Angels, and thanks for sharing and liking the videos and coming into the live sessions. And for the new people, welcome to the channel, and I hope you will join us in the live sessions. And please like and sub uh, 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 like and share the videos as well. And of course, please subscribe and hit the bell and click on all. Then you'll be notified when I go live and when new vid videos are loaded up. I'm sorry I'm sniffy because I've got a bit of a cold. Sorry. Okay. Um, I go live on Monday, Wednesday and Friday. I give free cards and I'm also there to answer questions and I can answer the questions with a super chat or a super sticker. And if you need more information because you would like an extended reading, if I can help you with that, I'll be honoured to uh, give you an extended reading. Please go to the um, website or uh, and have a look for the information. There's more information below this video in the description box and here you've got a little white circle with an eye in it and that um, will take you to the website and you can see what uh, readings are on offer. Like I said I'm using the Archangel Metatron deck and the Mythic deck and the Tea Leaf cards. Uh, I, I see them appearing everywhere now. They're beautiful little cards and you've got the f flute. The flute disappointment in a friend or a lover. Somebody might have hurt your feelings but I'm sure that will be m uh, mended very quickly or um, will change because you've got a positive card underneath it and that's the chariot. That means recognition, public recognition. So if somebody has hurt your feelings they most probably recognize that they did and they will uh, hopefully um, make it up to you. The chariot means um, public recognition and success, victory. You're going forwards and upwards. That might be a promotion. Okay, you might be moving home and or you might be going on holiday. And you'll be going on holiday with something that has wheels. This could be a car, this could be a train, um, this could be a bike, this could be a motorbike or a normal bike, and even an aeroplane because those have wheels as well. Because you can see the wheels on the chariot. Now, the Archangel Metatron card is a beautiful card. You've got the baby, and you've got the masculine sign and the feminine sign, and you've got the heart. Isn't that beautiful? I love the way that's done. Evolution. Something is evalu uh, evaluing, uh, evaluating or uh, evolving. Sorry, no, evolving. But I'm getting these words, uh, evaluation as well. So perhaps you might be uh, evaluating your friendship with um, due to this disappointment. So birthing a new idea perhaps, birthing a child, birthing a project, perhaps you're birthing an idea, putting an idea into practice. You've got number 40, so this idea is really built on sound, uh, on a sound from a foundation. So it will bring in uh, its um, harvest in the long run, because 4 is a proper foundation. And look at that, like I said, you've already, is good news, and you're going upwards, you're, you've got victory. On Wednesday you have the jug, light-hearted and carefree. 
you might be a little bit more playful letting your inner child come out on Wednesday as you are more uh, light-hearted and carefree you've got the king of wands you've got a lot of fire you've got a lot of love because you've got the red and orange and pink okay so there's a lot of action this week and you've got the king of wands and the king of wands is an Aries so you might be meeting an Aries Leo but it could be you don't um, uh, exclude the other fire signs you are the the queen of wands but um, you might be partnering up because the king is here so it could be partnering up with an Aries or an other Leo or an Sagittarius he knows what he wants and he goes for it he takes action he stands for passion he stands for action he stands for creativity and because um, uh, this new idea that you are wanting or wishing to put into a uh, birthing situation uh, in bring it into life I think you will succeed you will go for it like the king of wands if you're not meeting one and you've got an angel number here the angels are also with you uh, besides Archangel Metatron because you've got 22 and you've got Archangel Sandalphon with you now so he's um, an angel of harmony an angel of music he will bring harmony into your life so I think he will be helping you and supporting you uh, by guiding you the right way to get what you wish and bringing you into action then on Friday you have the staff you will be taken care of in dif difficult times well that is Archangel Sa uh, um, Sandalphon but um, of course you have people around you it could be the king of fire that will help you in difficult times perhaps um, if in, in the up startup period it's always difficult to get that recognition but you will you will succeed don't give up especially when you're this close to the end of things as the end is in sight because you've got the ten of ones where there is an ending there is a new beginning Wow then you've got number 19 and that be becomes a 10 and a 10 is of course an ending and a new beginning fire dragons strength you have dragons strength fire and you've got number 19 1 and 9 becomes a 10 and it's uh, this dragon also reminds me of the Phoenix rising from the ashes so there's definitely beautiful things happening for you lots of action it's I think this week will be a very very busy week for you Leo and then you've got carrot opportunity or a windfall what did I say don't give up don't give up when you're so close to the end okay that's an ending a new beginning again 10 is a one uh, 10 is an ending there's a new beginning because a 10 becomes a 1 again you've got a 10 here an ending confirming the 10 of 1's and make saying that you there's an ending so there is like um, the Phoenix rising from the ashes and you've got the carrot opportunity or a windfall I, like I said the king of uh, wands might even help you financially you'll be taken care of by the king of wands and uh, and the archangel Metatron and you've got the four of swords also take your time for rest and meditation contemplation so that you can carry on in the right way um, take your rest don't get burnt out because you've got so much orange and red here you've got number 24 here and number 24 becomes a 6 you will be in balance you will get yourself back in balance orange connection and attunement be in tune uh, with your ideas and your actions bring them into balance don't burn out like I said take it easy 
that if you do things in haste, you have to repent in leisure. You've got the carrot opportunity in windfall. And look at the overall energy. Happy families, the Ten of Pentacles, a pay rise. You, you might be getting a gift. You might be getting an inheritance. There is an ending, so perhaps some some somebody uh, has left this realm and has left you some money behind. New beginnings, perhaps an extension of the family because it's expending, right? And that's what this card overall means expending you could be expending or extending um, uh, evolution means that as well evolving uh, yeah, evolving something is coming something is uh, becoming more so you've got the baby here so that's why I would also say it is more than likely for a lot of you that you will find out that you're pregnant um, um, or that you are giving birth to a baby this could be a baby but this could also be a new project or a new job so that you can have a leisure time with the family um, and celebrate there will be more money coming in so that you can buy a bigger house, extend or evolve onto a higher level of living, uh, expending a bit, from going from an apartment to a house. Okay, and again, this is really prominent in your reading, Leo. Too many new beginnings. Again, a 10. A 10, new dawn, welcome back, welcome back, there's a new beginning. And here again, something, you've got the acoustic uh, records, you might have learned from the past, this is your previous lives, uh, okay, um, evaluation and review, like I said, evaluate don't burn out take time out and evaluate don't do things in too much of a hurry otherwise you have to repent in leisure right now I'm going to this is an amazing reading because you've got 10 here you've got 10 here you've got 10 here and you've got 10 there so you've got four tens 10 10 10 so the angels are showing you that they are there the signs are here again 22 22 is an angels number awesome I love this reading I wish you all the luck I know you will have a, um, a, a doubtful moment this week but you will get there Perse persevere okay persevere because beautiful things are going to happen for you magnificent wow so take care and i hope you have enjoyed this reading let me know if it resonates with you and of course i hope to see you or get acquainted with you in the live sessions take care be blessed and stay safe